The breaking news this hour involving the U.S. Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito. For the second time in two weeks, there is now reporting that a provocative flag embraced by Trump supporters was flown at one of uh, Samuel Alito's homes. This time, it's in his vacation house out in New Jersey. Our justice correspondent, Jessica Schneider, is joining us now. She's got the details. Tell us about this New York Times report, this latest one, Jessica. Yeah, Wolf, apparently numerous neighbors at that Long Beach Island home are talking to the New York Times, telling them about this most recent flag. Of course, you know, it was just last week on Friday that there were those reports of the upside down or inverted American flag that was seen carried by supporters of the Stop the Steal movement around January 6th at Alito's, Alito's Virginia home. This time, it's this so-called appeal to heaven flag. You're seeing it there, flown outside his home on Long Beach Island in New Jersey. Now, it has a history dating back to the Revolutionary War, but it has recently become a symbol for supporters of former President Donald Trump. Now, as for this most recent revelation, Justice Alito has not responded to these pictures uh, published by the New York Times. Um, we did hear from Justice Alito on Friday. He released a statement saying that the inverted flag outside his Virginia home that was placed there leading up to Joe Biden's inauguration in 2021, he said it was placed there by his wife in response to a spat with neighbors. As for this time with the revelations of the flag outside his New Jersey beach home, our team has reached out to the court. We have not heard back. Um, it's interesting and maybe important to note, our producer on Capitol Hill actually saw this same appeal to heaven flag flying outside House Speaker Mike Johnson's office just tonight. She talked to the speaker and he said, it's George Washington's flag. It goes back to the founders era. I've always flown that flag. It has nothing to do with that when asked about associations with Stop the Steal or Donald Trump. Now, of course, Wolf, we'll, you know, Speaker Johnson is a politician. Justice Alito is really supposed to be an impartial justice here, one of nine sitting on the, the country's highest court. And already from last week, we heard Democrats calling for Justice Alito to recuse himself from any cases associated with January 6th. And there are two that we are awaiting rulings on. One actually involves whether certain Capitol rioters charged with obstruction can still be charged under a particular federal statute. The other case, of course, is the big one, whether Donald Trump should be immune from criminal prosecution as it relates to his January 6th case. We have not heard any comment from Justice Alito about those calls to recuse, and we also haven't heard a statement from Justice Alito about this most recent revelation from the New York Times. But no doubt, Wolf, calls could keep growing, um, you know, now that this latest revelation has come out in the New York Times.